Angelina, what was it like stepping back into the role of Lara Croft? Uh, it was a it was a, a lot of fun. It was kind of it did feel like coming back. Huh? I got when I first arrived, I got a package and it said uh, welcome home. It was a, a lot of fun. It was kind of it did feel like coming back. Huh? I got when I first arrived, I got a package and it said uh, welcome home, Lara. And it had all these little things in it and on my and uh, and it felt great. It felt um, I missed I missed her. Yeah. Uh, I missed playing her and I and I wanted to go back on another adventure and um, and this time I I'm. I felt that we did it uh, more, more the way I wanted to do it the first time around, and so I was much happier through this entire shoot, and I felt that we were doing it better, and we did do it better, I think. Wonderful. What do you think of video games as the new comics in Hollywood, a uh, new source for upcoming feature films? I think that's, I think just, I don't think it's necessarily going to make a good movie if it's been a good video game right. or a good comic book. Um, I think she's an, an exception because the character stood out before we did the film. Um, so I don't know, I don't know many video games, so I don't sure. know. Have you played uh, the Tomb Raider games at all? I have, and I find them very difficult. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it's Stop, very frustrating. Stuff. Right. And um, I don't think Laurel would have the patience for it either, so I think <laughs> the two of us are, it's better we can just go on the adventure and not have to play them. Right, and then with the adventures themselves, with uh, the stunts are just phenomenal. Uh, is there anything that you wouldn't do in the in there's nothing field. that I wouldn't do. There were certain things maybe I wasn't insured to do and they wouldn't let me do, but the, there's not much I wouldn't do. What was your favorite stunt out of all the stunts you um, did, if you could name one? I liked landing in the Jeep mm. with the parachute. I liked uh, the horse, even though that was difficult. I liked riding on the horse. You had to learn to ride side saddle. Ride side saddle and spin a shotgun and, <laughs> yeah, keep a horse calm through all of that. Yeah. I mean, things, just little details I noticed, like with the butterfly knife. Mm -hmm. You're just flipping that around without even thinking yeah. about it. You know, how much effort goes into that, all the little details. Well, that actually somehow, I, I've, I've had butterfly knives for years, so that really? was one of my little, that's what I do when I'm on the phone at home, <laughs> actually. <Nice. laughs> it's that clicking. Great. Was there any time uh, that you were frightened doing any of the stunts at all? Is, is, do you, are you I, afraid of anything? I'm not, not really. I'm, I'm, in my life, I'm only afraid something happens to somebody I love. That's my, the only thing that frightens me. But. I wasn't really afraid, but I certainly was uncomfortable certain times the underwater um, without any oxygen and getting nervous that it wasn't going to get to me. Claustrophobia. When I needed it, and my foot was on, I couldn't unhook my foot, and I couldn't get the, the oxygen, and right. things like that. Do you have any scars or injuries that you uh, got on the I side? I have a smashed in right elbow. How? MRI? Did you get it? We, you know, we got all these things, and they kind of just didn't know what to do with it. They just said it's, it's in there, the pieces floating around somewhere it might surface. <laughs> <So>. <laughs> just live with it. I don't know where it is. Hey, where's my bone? Where's my elbow? It's somewhere in my body. <laughs> well, thank you very much, Angelina. It's a pleasure. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you.